Hi everyone, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to turn your router into a switch. So the first thing that you need to do is to reset the router. Go to system, reset configuration, and you're going to select no default configuration. This will just wipe out all the settings from the router entirely and give you a router with no settings whatsoever. Yes reset so at this time you will you'll be disconnected um, from the router and when you are logging in you'd have to log in via the MAC address because the router will not have any IP address so um, I'm currently connecting by the IP address but I won't be able to use this IP address anymore because the router will be reset so it has it has been reset so I'm just waiting on the router so it's actually rebooting so I'm waiting on the router to come up. So you'd have to use the neighbors and the sit refresh and wait until the router shows up. All right, so the router has rebooted. So we're going to select the MAC address. And by default, the router doesn't have any password. So and the username is admin. So we're going to connect. So now we are connected to the router. All right, so what I'm going to do is we're going to go to bridge and I'm going to create a bridge and I'm going to call this just call this bridge OK and then in ports I'm going to add all the ports of this router to the bridge but I'm just going to add the Ethernet ports alone just for this to just make it much simpler so I'm going to add Ethernet 1 Ethernet 2 and Ethernet and add Ethernet 3. So some of you might be disconnected at times, so you just reconnect and just continue adding your ports. So this router is one of the app mini. It only has three ports. But you I think you'll really understand the concept of what I'm doing. So now I'm able to add all three ports to this router, to this bridge. So any one of these ports that you are plugged into will be a part of the same network. All of this is actually one, one switch with three ports. Now that is what you would need to do to turn your router into a network switch. So that's it for this tutorial. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, please remember to do so. So thanks for watching.